Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. Got a question here asked on LockerGnome.net. Red Channel is wondering, does having Microsoft certifications really help with finding a job? Well, I don't know if it's going to help you find a job, but in terms of getting a job, absolutely. More education, more opportunity. In fact, if you were to imagine yourself as someone in human resources, an HR department, and you were looking at two people who look, you know, exactly the same on paper, except one big difference. Uh, the position you're hiring for, let's say, has something to do with technologies related to, well, this question, Microsoft technology, server stuff, you know, programming, coding, and client and server work. And one of those individuals had no certifications, and the other individual had 20. Which one would you go with? Everything being equal. More likely going to be going with the person who has more education. Certainly education that they didn't have to get. Unless, of course, the job requires that you have certifications. Um, if it's shown that you've taken the time to actually attain more knowledge, to parlay that into your own wisdom, uh, that is always going to be seen as a good thing. It's to my knowledge, never been bad to show that you've learned more, that you took the time to gain a sheet of paper. But it's more than just a sheet of paper. That shows that you have stick to which, you know, could be a very positive trait, at least as far as, you know, being viable in the job market is concerned. You have to remember, you're going up against quite a few people. So you got to do whatever you can to separate yourself, to make yourself look better. Certifications of any kind, whether they're related to Microsoft or not, are a good thing. Could they cost you a lot of money? Sure. But how much is that next job worth to you? It won't help you finding a job, but it will, more often than not, help you get that job. One thing they can't take away from you is what you know. Unless, of course, it's like a frontal lobotomy. Uh, don't really want to go that direction with this particular video. I, I think you, you get the point. I say, do it. Do it. Maybe you have a different opinion. Cool. Uh, you're more than welcome to post it as a comment if you haven't already. A video response would be just as great. Uh, YouTube.com slash Chris Perlow. You're more than likely already responding there. Then we've got Facebook.com slash Chris Perlow, a, a thread uh, related to this particular video. Chris.Perlow.com, at Chris Perlow on Twitter. Geeks.Perlow.com. Plenty of people have certification advice to give over there. And LockerDome.com as well. We have Matt Hartley, the IT blogger. We also have uh, uh, openings for other people who like blogging about uh, uh, information related to certifications, Microsoft-related or not. Uh, just drop me a line, Chris at Perillo.com. And then, of course, the chat room at live.perillo.com and a place where you can answer this particular thread uh, as initiated by the person wondering about certifications. Uh, and that's a place you can ask questions, tech-related or not, and you can answer questions, whether they're tech-related or not. 24 hours a day, seven days a week, at lockernome.net. We'll see you later.